Good morning, y'all. Uh, it's Chris with Fake Rich and Tired. Thank you all for just all of the support and some of you all who have reached out to me who are like, yeah, we're going to jump in on the challenge as well. Um, for those of you who don't know, we are on a journey to become debt free before we are 40. Uh, quick disclaimer, I'm almost 37. So that's to give you an idea. And I never tell my age, but uh, we're looking at uh, three years being uh, debt free. We have um, and I'll break it down a little bit more later, but when we started, we were looking at probably about $175,000, $180,000 in debt. Um, that number may change depending on some things going on, like with the IRS and some other things we are working on getting adjusted right now. But let's say we are working on toward paying off $175,000 worth of debt in the next three years. And that is because we have a plan to do that. Um, most people who are on a debt-free journey that I've been watching are doing the uh, Dave Ramsey uh, snowball method and the um, five or seven baby steps. And I've read Dave Ramsey's Total Money Makeover. I am mostly in agreement with everything that he does. Uh, the only reason that I would say I am not following Dave Ramsey's plan uh, is because, one, he, uh, the, the baby step two, which is probably the biggest part of the getting out of debt part, um, we're doing a little bit different. We're taking a different approach, which I'm going to show you all in a different video um, how we do that. And it's also on my blog at fakerichattire.com. Um... So our baby step two is a little bit different than what he does. And the reason that I say that we're getting out of debt, I'm sorry about the sunlight, guys. Um, but the reason that I say that we're getting out of debt and not in the Dave Ramsey way like everybody else uh, is because I've, I've listened to like his radio shows and things. And then people call in and they say, oh, well, you know, I'm, I'm going through your method, except for I'm doing this a little bit different. He'll just say, well, you're not doing my method. So I feel, I feel as though he's a little bit judgy about it. So I'm going forth by saying I'm not 100% doing the Dave Ramsey method. But it's very similar. We're going to be paying off a certain amount of debt and, and getting gazelle intense and focusing on one debt at a time. It's just how we are arranging the debts. It's a little bit different. It's a method that we learned uh, from Robert and Kim Kiyosaki who are both very wealthy as well their method also came out probably a little bit after Dave Ramsey came out with the snowball method so I mean it's been like 20 something years it's just something that they probably didn't approach like Dave Ramsey did um, and if you don't know who they are uh, Robert Kiyosaki is the author of uh, his most probably well-known book is Rich Dad Poor Dad so the method that we're using is something that they did an audio book on called How I Got Out of Bad Debt. And I will put a link to that in a description. It has been hard to find because I got this audio book probably like uh, four or five years ago. But it's a very, very good method. And I think that the approach that it takes is... I won't necessarily say better. Yes, I will. It's a little bit better than how uh, Dave Ramsey's approach is to me because once you tackle a certain debt, I think it gives you a better amount of money. I'm so sorry about this light, everyone. Let your light shine. But it gives you more money to put toward the next debt. So I've looked around. Most people don't do it this way. I've seen the debt snowball method. I've seen the debt avalanche. I've seen... Uh, the I forgot what the lady called it but it was like the debt snowflake method or something like that. I've seen a lot of different methods I have not really seen anyone do it like Robert and Kim say to do it which I think is a fantastic method and I will probably do that in the next video I do have a couple other videos that I filmed that I just haven't posted about us like cooking and meal prepping and stuff um, that may come between there but coming up very soon I'm going to 
hopefully have a time to sit down in front of my whiteboard and show you guys the method and why it works. Um, it's still very easy, just like Dave Ramsey's method. You know, Dave Ramsey is you pay off the smallest debt to the largest debt. This one has more of an impact, in my opinion, because you still get those big wins. You still have that laser focus. It's just going to free up more money to pay your debt off sooner, in my opinion. Uh, so just update on us right now. Like I said, we're we're in a similar place where we're following Dave Ramsey's method, where uh, we're doing baby steps. We're starting at baby step uh, 0.5 or zero, where he says where we have to get current on our bills, and that was kind of where we had fallen off. Uh, we have a couple of things that we have to uh, work some arrangements out with. Like I said, the IRS is one. We have a credit card bill that we had some issues with an old credit card bill so um we are working that out as well as some household things so once we get that in place we'll be moving to baby step one or whatever you want to call it since we're not doing the dave ramsey method but um dave ramsey's baby step one is to save up uh, at least a thousand dollars for an emergency well he says a thousand dollars for an emergency fund uh, because of our income and kind of how things uh, are at our home, I think we're going to go for a little bit more than that um, because we have had a few emergencies and I know that $1,000, it, it would help, but I think we're going to stretch for a little bit more than that 1000 So we will hopefully be moving into baby step one sometime early December we're looking at the next couple weeks we should be able to at least get started on baby step one um, one of our advantages is um, our our family celebrates uh, Kanuka or Hanukkah and not necessarily Christmas so um, we don't have like a lot of shopping to do around the holidays like most people do um, so that's going to be a big advantage for us um, and then my husband, uh, around the beginning of the year, uh, usually gets his annual bonus. Um, so that's really going to help us really jump into some things, too. I probably shouldn't dispose all his business like that, but it's, he, I don't know. Um, but that's going to help us to really jump into making sure that we have our emergency fund set up and start snowballing. I shouldn't say snowballing, but we're, we're snowballing our debt. It's just in a different approach. So that's just the update. I will um, be posting a blog as soon as possible. It's just been tough with a new job. Um, it's easier for me to film because I'm driving to work. So make sure that you please just subscribe to the channel to follow our journey. Check out the blog. Subscribe to the blog. And um, we also will be on Instagram. I'll probably be posting most of the, the cooking pictures and stuff on Instagram so you guys can see uh, what the girls and I have been doing with meal prep. It's been really fun. Uh, we've been just making more things at home. And this is totally off topic, so I'm going to cut this off soon. But just it's it's been so much fun just going out, sh actually shopping, cooking at home with them because they love to cook. So I'll be posting some of that on Instagram. So everything that we have is uh, fake, rich, and tired. So, so it's fake, rich, and tired .com is where the blog is. Our Instagram is at fake, rich, and tired. Uh, Twitter I haven't posted on, but I will be posting on is fake, rich, the letter N, tired. And of course here on YouTube, fake, rich, and tired. So thank you all for your support. I hope that you join us on this journey. Oh, I will be. I'm still editing my spreadsheets and my budget sheets so that you all can try to utilize them. And I'll be doing a video on how, how to use those too. Um, I just want to make sure to tweak some things because I know how to manipulate it because I've been using them now for years. Um, but I don't just want to put it out there and then you don't know how to use it and then I'll have a lot of questions. Um, so I'm manipulating that a little bit. So I'll post those and do a video on those too soon as well. So thank you all again. Please comment here on the video. It really helps and uh, make sure to subscribe and I will see you guys soon. Bye.